guys it is sunday morning and i am down pembrokeshire you would have seen from the last video i slept well last night uh, today i am off the skoma island i'm about an hour away um it's only 20 past seven i need to go to the tesco's and get some food first but i am looking forward to it i have no emails to say it's cancelled my boat is until 12 o'clock. I'm hoping if I go there early, they may have some space on one of the um, earlier, you know, trips onto the island. It's a bit cooler today at the minute, which is good, but I don't have a hoodie on me because I forgot one. I'm just chilling at the minute. I'm gonna make some breakfast. Sorry, I was, uh, well, that's another story to explain. I'm just gonna have some breakfast now and chill out for a bit, then try find the Tesco's, Morrison's, whatever, and get some supplies for the island. And yeah, I'll just catch you in a bit now. Just having a little stop off guys at Newgale. I love this place so much. I am actually going to camp in my campsite one day. Another gorgeous day. Winds don't seem too bad for Skomer Island as well, which is good. Right then guys, I did just get you. Uh, I paid for parking. As you can see, the sun is starting to come out and it's going to be another glorious day. I did stop at the shop for some supplies. Um, it's about 20 past nine and I don't have to go until 11 but i'm gonna go down there now try my luck and see if i can get on a earlier boat um but i'll keep you guys updated if not i'm just gonna have a little walk around and explore i think so i didn't do much of that last time so guys um i did try my luck unfortunately there are no spaces at the minute on the earlier boats but what i might do is guys um i might try get an earlier boat back so my boat is back at five o'clock and this is two and a half hours from my house without stopping so you know i want to be home a bit earlier now so I, what i may do is um 12. i may try to get like the four o'clock one if there is a four o'clock but i'm pretty sure this the next one will be three um so mine is at 12 so i'd get there around what half 12 one two i don't know if i want to spend all our money for uh, two hours so I'll just see how it goes pretty much um, I'll probably end up staying till five and trying to get some photos I'm hoping there's gonna be a lot of puffing birds on the island there should be because I'm here a lot earlier than I was last year it would have been better if I could have come like three weeks ago but it is what it is I'm here now uh, I'm just currently waiting to obviously board I've still got a few hours though, so I may go for a walk. I'm just going to chill in the van and I need to check the air conditioning on because it is absolutely boiling in here, guys. And I did want to also add, guys, that this trip for the weekend is fully booked for ages, and I mean ages. And that's why I've got such a late time slot because everybody is going for the earlier ones, but pretty much like every Saturday is booked up um this was going to be the last chance for me because they start leaving early august i believe um so that's why i'm trying to come now so i can get more photos and some videos i'm excited to get on there and i just want to let you know that our update but yeah it's pretty much mental you've got to come here in the week which i find hard really so so guys it is 10 to 11 obviously this is the boat we will be going on in a hour um so basically you've got to be there 10 minutes before i think it takes around 15 minutes to get to the island if that so i'm currently just chilling here now so excited to get on the island i've just seen some live footage from the shop guys and they're still plenty of puffins on there didn't buy anything from the shop this time because it's pretty much the same as last year but yeah just so excited to get on the boat now 
there are other birds on the island as well guys and obviously other wildlife that I will try to get some photos of but the main thing for me was puffins there's also a chance of seals because I remember last time it, was, it melted our boat I remember as we was coming in last time there was like a boat there and there was actually one chilling in there a seal so hopefully we see some seals today even a rare chance of dolphins even though they've been seen in Port Cole which it's amazing actually because I was only paddle boating there the other day but look at guys it's absolutely gorgeous down here cooler day today which makes it better because there's not really any shade on the island at all and it's just a waiting game now so photography wise guys it is quite good conditions not windy not really too windy a bit cloudy but it is what it is uh, I think I'm gonna head straight to the puffins uh, get my photos and then just chill around I think I still got a pin on my map to be honest I may even head to Ramsey as well next year guys there's also puffins on there and apparently it's a nice island um, I don't even know what other species of birds is actually on the island but it was stunning last time you know all of the wild rabbits and stuff running around it's just gonna be it's gonna be an incredible few hours now it's gonna be well worth it I think I'm literally gonna see more. Well, I've seen more than three already. Look around behind me now. Look around, guys. They are literally everywhere. Right, I'm gonna go get some photos now, guys. See you in a bit. What an amazing experience this is guys again. Got lucky with the weather. So glad they weren't cancelled this time. So many puffins on the island. Like I said, I seen like three or four last time. Eh? Um, so hopefully gonna get some really good shots. I got one or two flying, but I wanna try and improve on that. So that's what that is. Um, probably gonna head the toilet first. Take me down to um, I got a pin where I was taking photos last year. But yeah, guys, just so happy to be back. I'm so happy to see so many puffins on the island. I forgot how breathtaking this place actually is, guys. Look at it. It's absolutely amazing. I wonder if the Welsh couple are working here yeah? that um, was here when I was here last year. And it was also this very path guys where a little bunny rabbit literally ran across my feet this is what i live for this is the life wow so guys the, um, apparently this year is the highest recorded year for the puffin birds um, and apparently this estimated to have been 30,000 landing on the island this year. Now, if you come in the beginning of June, that's probably one of your best times. And I don't know what that chair is for, but I'm going to carry on walking a bit. Right then guys, so I'm pretty much uh, done with the puffins. Cool experience. I spent most of my time here trying to get photos. Um, I didn't get any in-flight ones, unfortunately. I managed to get one or two, possibly, I don't know. Um, also managed to get a puffin with fish in his mouth on the floor, which was pretty cool. Um, 
So I'm just walking around the island now. Um, I filled two cards and my battery's dead. So on my camera, I have got two other batteries, but I'm good now. I've taken all the photos I wanted to take. Um, so I'll just show you a little bit more of the island. So I'm going to walk back to the boat now because I'm pretty much done and hoping to get an earlier ship back or boat back. Right then guys, that's it. Back in the van. Um, another brilliant day on Skomer Island. I think I got some really nice photos. Incredible day and another incredible uh, day out the house because uh, obviously I'd come down last night as well. Um, yeah, so if you are new to this channel, Please consider subscribing for more videos like this and travel related content. Everybody, please smash that like button, leave a like on the